Hello everybody, I'm GHG and welcome back to the second episode of this tutorial series on Blender Low Poly Art. And in today's episode we are going to create a fern tree. To create a fern tree I'm going to create a new cylinder and this time with 8 vertices. I know this has been done many times on the internet but I just want to show how I create my trees. And I'm going to center this by clicking on the cube and typing in 0 for everything so that it get centered then just move it up until it looks quite right does not really matter it's just for me to get it centered go into set, uh, edit mode uh, scale it down like this do not scale it down too much yet uh, just scale it up actually scale it up and choose the top and make it a little bigger and just go and make this one to zero and then contour shit and then um this is how a fern tree looks no just kidding uh, we're gonna add a uh, loop cut so go into tools go into loop cut and slide in the middle and if you move your mouse wheel up you'll see i will do three four five loop cuts just like that do not move them if you accidentally move them just right click and that's it for the loop cut and we're gonna get add more loop cuts. So Ctrl R is a shortcut. Add loop cuts in between all of these, and immediately move them down. Click and S and scale them up like this. It does not look right now. I know, but we will make it look right in a second. Just go there, scale it up, and then do the same over here. Scale it up. Do the same over here. Yep, scale it up. Do the same over here. Down, scale it up with S. And same over here. Down, scale it up with S. And let me check. Does this look right? Yeah, kind of. Not a pro artist, as I said in the beginning. So do not expect me to make real cool fern trees. And then I'm just going to select the bottom phase. I'm going to scale it down. It will look a little funky. A little funky uh, because... Uh, this will not scale with it, so we're gonna select this one and just press uh, your um, the dot on your numpad key so that it will center around the select face. And we're gonna select all these edges like that, all the bottom edges over here to scale this down as well. Scale it down on about the same, just a little shorter. And as you can see, we created a nice looking low poly fern tree you can go uh, and add little details but i just like to keep it like this and go into face selection mode again press a to select all phases go towards your uh, materials add a new material new call this leaves as well as the previous episode and make it green but make it a little darker add another one uh, over here with the plus select the faces of the trunk again by holding shift you can select multiple faces and then just uh, assign them to the next material make a new one call this trunk trunk point 001 because uh, the other one also had trunk and then just make it a brownish color like that i'm gonna bring back my plane so that you can see the plane i'm gonna move this a little bit backwards so that it actually gets inside of the view completely not that much backwards uh, to the back and going to render it if you can see uh, it's a nice fern tree the bottom thing looks a bit too white and these are a bit weird but that's because I'm not a pro artist I'm just gonna show you the way how to do this you need to invest a little more time to get that right and just practice with it and uh, just the technique not how to master it and that's it for today's episode on how to create a fern tree. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe. And of course, this is the second episode and there will be four more. Unless you're really excited about seeing more of this series. And I hope to see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Bye.